Hello Darts Nuts, I'm going to do a, a review of another set of Godspeed soft tip darts. Um, these are the Keita or Keita 1 darts and these come in a slightly different packaging than the others. Um, quite a neat style packaging and it's got this slide out uh, tray a little bit tight and that's just for the shop display I should imagine yeah some uh, clever designs in packaging these days and as you can see the darts are fitted in this form insert very uh, tightly packed in by the looks of it see if I can get them out. Doesn't help when you've got fat fingers. Oh, that's easy. Now, they come with uh, your Godspeed standard shape flights and these are, I'd say they're short or they could be extra short stems. I'll just compare them with my own Yeah, I think they're short. They look like short gripper uh, shafts. So you got this form insert, which is quite neatly cut to take the shape of everything. And then the barrels are already fitted with soft tip points. And these um, are 17 gram darts. Don't think there's any information on like it was on the other barrels unless some of that writing is telling you about the weight and that but I don't think it is and these are a 90% tungsten dart and they retail for 10,500 yen and I think there's a another key to model as well I can't remember what it's called I don't know if it's called the the Kita 1 Pro or Kita Owner or something like that, but uh, I like the look of this particular uh, barrel design. It's another barrel that's got a very uh, neatly cut and very th thinly cut ring style grip. It's quite nicely uh, done again. They all seem to be very nicely machined, the Asian barrels. And it's also got a very nice profile as well, and it feels quite grippy that. Almost a bit like a micro style grip, and a little bit edgier on the rings at the back. Um, I said these are 10,500 yen, which is around £54, I think. It all depends on what the exchange rate is and that's what the dart looks like set up and again it's another dart with a rear grip but has quite a nice uh, comfortable profile so we'll have a close look at the barrels now right here's the quick close look then I'll put the detail picture up as usual and as usual they're fitted with a soft tip point 2BA thread on both ends so uh, you could effectively swap it around put this point on that end if you wanted but I don't think it'd be balanced right and like I say it's got quite a nice profile to it it slightly tapers at the front slightly wider there then tapers towards the, the rear of the barrel and it's got this uh, very thinly cut ring style grip with these uh, lateral grooves cut into the barrel that just adds a little bit more rolling resistance I don't know how well you can see it on the camera but uh, it's a very finely cut uh, grip but I'd say it's maybe yeah, probably me high medium I would say 
has quite a bit of bite to it though and then it kind of like tapers on that very little rib section there so depending on how you grip your dart you might find that quite comfortable but uh, I think I'm okay gripping it there and normally with depending on the length of the dart but normally I grip quite close to the point but it's not a, a particularly long barrel so it feels uh, well enough balanced there for my grip and then you've got these short gripper shafts and then the Godspeed standard flights so I'll just let you look at the dart then I'll put the detailed picture up Okay, here's the detail picture. Right then, here's the close look at the Kaita Ono 17 gram soft tip darts. It's got a 25 millimeter soft tip point. The front section of the barrel is mostly smooth, apart from the few little notches near where the lateral cuts are. That's 15.8 millimeters wide. And then it starts off with a kind of a thin ring grip and it gradually gets into slightly bigger rings and wider grooves that's 15.6 millimeters wide before it gets into a combination grip of a kind of a kind of like a shark curved ring grip with uh, pretty wide grooves in between and double ring grips that goes right to the end of the barrel which is about 10.5 millimeters wide overall length is 42 millimeters and the width is 7.1 millimeters right then let's take some measurements along the barrel the barrel length is 42 millimeters 42.06 and the widest part looks to be around here on this very thinly cut ring grip that is 7.1 millimeters a little bit chunkier than I thought actually um, yep 7.1 and then on this rear section goes down to 6.85 and then it was down a little bit more near the end 6.15 and then you've got this uh, tapered section which goes from 7.1 and tapers down to 6 millimeters all right I'll just uh, compare the weight of the barrels now that one is 17.04 grams uh, that is 17.04 and that is 17.04 so nicely matched set exactly matched and the weight of the full setup as supplied is 18.69 grams right and I'll see if I can find the balance point with no points or shafts attached um, yeah it's just around about there so it is front weighted with nothing attached and with the point attached uh, yeah, it's still pretty close to the front and with the supplied setup these are only short um, stems though it's almost spot in the middle I'd say just about there so it's on those very finely cut rings 
So if you're a rear gripper or you're going to grip round about there, you're just going to be just behind that balance point there. I'm probably going to be gripping it around there, so I'm almost on the balance point with my grip. So that's the uh, detailed look at the Godspeed Kita or Kita one darts. It's another very nicely uh, designed barrel. So let's give them a throw and see how they go. I'm holding the dart uh, kind of, well it's almost in the middle, it's a fairly short barrel so my grip, even though I'm a front gripper, it's going to be pretty close to the middle but I'd just say it's probably just front of the centre on these very fine grooves and this like lateral cuts in the barrel. Uh, there's a fair amount of grip there, it's uh, quite a bit more grippy than it first looks it's kind of like a, a micro style grip but I can feel some bite into my fingers I'd probably still say it's maybe just a medium maybe verging onto a high medium it's definitely a lot more grippy there on that rear section but uh, just from the first few throws there the dart seems to be very nicely balanced it's very uh, easy to throw as well it's hard to explain but uh, Sometimes I have issues with the light darts, but not with these. It just seems to be very sweetly balanced for my grip. I'm just going to carry on throwing a few more from there, and then I'll probably try gripping from the rear to see how it works from there. Yeah, this is a really nice uh, flying dart. Um, the balance just seems to be perfect, especially gripping it there. For me, it, it just seems very nicely weighted and nicely balanced. Uh, just for the sake of experiment, I'm just going to try uh, gripping from the rear. Obviously, it looks as if the dart is made for a rear grip, but uh, I'm getting away with it really well and nice from there. But uh, I'm going to try on that section now. just feels a little bit more awkward for me there it's just simply because it's further away from where my natural grip is but if you're a natural uh, rear gripper it's going to be very nicely balanced there it still feels like it's a nicely balanced start even at that rear 
just from them couple of throws but it's just because it's not quite my natural grip but for there gripping it on there it just seems to be the sweet spot for me so I'm gonna go back to that grip the uh, Godspeed Keita 1 17 gram darts uh, the thing that strikes me most about these darts is they just seem to be very nice balanced overall uh, for me obviously with it being a front gripper it, it felt a little bit better there than it did at the rear but the balance just seemed to be just as good even from the rear even though it's not my natural grip so it's definitely going to suit a rear grip but I think middle and front grippers will get away with it well because the balance is really nice. Um, the thing as well I like it, I, that grip there is a little bit more aggressive but I actually like that grip better it just has the a kind of like a fine feel to it but I'm quite a big fan of like micro grip anyway so the feel of that grip kind of suits me and it just throws really nice from there quite impressed with these little darts so there you go that's the end of the review thanks for watching